Hi, this is Danny 8-Bit here, and after well over a thousand hours of development, I have great pleasure in presenting version 1.0 of the YouTube plugin for the PlayStation 3 bookmarklet. As you will see, this truly does give PS3 owners a YouTube experience worthy of the console and is available free for everyone. To find out how to set up the bookmarklet, see my accompanying video, The Quick Setup and Usage Guide. So let's kick things off with a search for PS3 of course, and I'm initially using a display resolution of 480p with the browser settings of plus one for resolution and full pixel for display. I haven't upgraded to firmware 3.42 from 3.41 as it will be somewhat of a disaster if Sony has done something in 3.42 that prevents the bookmarklet from running. Now YouTube is no fun at all without the, the pictures for the thumbnails so let's uh, run the bookmarklet on the page here. You just select it from the bookmark list once you've set it up. And it adds um, ratings to each of the videos in the search results. Um, but um, uh, if the YouTube server is uh, particularly busy, you can uh, always uh, skip that option by clicking the link shown there. I'll let it run through in this case. So this is more like it. And um, you can position the cursor on the thumbnail to show the slideshow of the pictures there, including for the, uh, the mini thumbnails at the end of the page. Um, these also show the title in a, a hypertext tooltip um, that I developed for, for PC browsers uh, and have adapted for use on the PlayStation 3. Um, and unlike with um, uh, the tooltip um, on a PC, um, I use a, a simple formula for determining how long to display the hypertip, which is the number of uh, words uh, plus one. Uh, so you always have enough time um, to read the, the text in the hypertip, that's seconds. Um, now for the, uh, the ratings uh, indicators, um, they allow you at a glance to gauge uh, how good a video is um, and they work just as well for videos with only single or double digit ratings um, as for Uber videos with hundreds of thousands of uh, ratings. Um, so that, that particular video there, uh, that's received roughly half and half of uh, thumbs ups and uh, thumbs downs. Um, whereas th this one here, um, it, that's obviously a lot more uh, popular. Um, now let's uh, go to the uh, PS3 videos for this month. And um, yeah, if you've used the uh, one of the upload date uh, search op options, um, you may have noticed that the, the videos are not in uh, descending order as you might expect. Um, so let's run the bookmarklet uh, on the page here. Um, so um, yes, I, I resort them into descending order, um, which you'll find very handy. You know, if you're returning to YouTube quite regularly to check out the latest videos, um, um, as it shows you the the most recent uh, video uh, in the list first. There you go. So there's one added 15 hours ago. Um, now. Um, what happens if you actually click a video link? Uh, let's try that. That gives you the option to load the video in a separate window on PS3 YouTube or YouTube, um, or in the current window on YouTube. So let's select the first option. And the first time you do that, um, that will t actually take you to the PS3 YouTube window, um, which um, allows you to watch, uh, presently allows you to watch videos in up to 480p. Um, so let's now go back to the YouTube, just press L2 there, uh, and let's try clicking another link, and OK to that. And um, so the second time you do that, um, you then uh, press R2 to switch back to the uh, PS3 YouTube window. And uh, so I can now play that by just clicking the, uh, the video there. So let's uh, let's close that window for a second, um, and um, yes, the other thing on the page here is the uh, what else is on here? Oh yes, um, now if you've used the uh, a previous version of the bookmarklet, you've uh, will have seen all those features, but you won't have seen this feature, the all new YouTube Q, which um, and this is the reason it's taken so long to release this version. Uh, 
getting this uh, working nicely on the PlayStation 3 has been um, uh, quite a challenge, shall we say. Uh, let me just add a nice uh, selection of videos here. Let's add a couple more. But um, yeah, I'm, um, uh, the end result um, I think you'll find is uh, quite good. Um, now in 480p resolution you might find it handy if you can um, collapse the queue like so uh, and still be able to add the videos. Uh, so I've actually re-added that feature, the YouTube had that themselves where they, as you see there, it re-collapses the, the queue once you've um, uh, added the video. Um, so let's now uh, re-expand the queue here just to show you some of the nice functionality. Um, I've made the, the menu here, you click the, the queue button, uh, semi-automatic, so uh, moving off of the menu like, like so dismisses it. Um, um, whereas on the PC it's static, which is, is not so uh, friendly. Um, and uh, let's move back through the list here so you could uh, jump to one of these videos in fact let's uh, if I click one of those so there you go it gives you the, the standard options um, let's cancel that uh, go back here and uh, let's try what if we try deleting that last one and there you go it takes you to the the last video in the list um, and there's a bit of a, a special option in here um, load videos on PS3 YouTube which I'll, I'll show you as a, uh, a grand finale um, so for the moment um, I'm actually going to exit the browser and switch to 720p resolution I'm going to jump to uh, YouTube's smart looking new videos page if there is a, a, an actual flash advert on the page it will take uh, slightly longer to to load up um, there you go, and uh, these these show the the high quality um, thumbnails there, very nicely animated. And the uh, let me show you with the the movies. Uh, the change here is I now show YouTube's um, hover cards um, uh, with the description there for the the movie. Um, and um, actually, let's go to. Uh, the movies page, why not? Just to show you that's um, and um, yeah, the um, if you've tried to use the with the remote control the uh, the search box at the top there, uh, you'll have trouble uh, because you can't actually get the cursor to the the the, the box. Uh, so I've obviously uh, fixed that. Uh, it's just a recent change. Um, uh, YouTube has made um, give that a second there you go just to show that the, you can actually get into the search box now um, and um, oh what's happened there that's more like it let's try that again um, and uh, yeah, this is, um, I, I actually take control of the, uh, the navigation here. When you press cursor right, um, I actually have to override where the cursor went there. Um, so it takes you where you actually want to go. Uh, because the, uh, the hover card um, is actually obscuring the, the thumbnail you want to get to. Uh, so there you go. So if I press cursor right now, see it cursor bobs off to the right and then I, I send it back where you actually wanted to get to um, which works quite well including for the the title there let's go to trailers how about I just want to show you the uh, the improvements to the video page so let's uh, run the bookmarklet on the page again oops I didn't actually give it there enough time to um, fully load, which you you must do. And it pauses the um, the video um, so it can uh, complete its stuff, and then it resumes playback. So let's pause that video again. Um, now um, on here, um, when you now expand the the videos uh, list, 
you can see I now update the uh, update the thumbnails there and let's come down and um, uh, also the character count is updated um, except um, in resolutions except 1080p um, you you have found that um, it disables the whole page until you actually um, save the changes so there you go so it's now updated to 489 um, whereas in 1080p it, 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 the count will actually um, change as you type um, okay let's come down to the bottom of the page here and let's load the more suggestions just give it the cursor a second there to catch up and give it another second and there you go and these are animated of course okay and the the comments uh, YouTube dynamically loads uh, each page of the comments so let's try uh, jump into page three why not and cursor up and there you go that's uh, that's loaded that um, and I switch there I use um, hyper tips for the uh, in place of the uh, YouTube's tooltips which work better on the PlayStation 3 so there you go that's the it gives you the exact um, uh, like dislike count there for the writings now um, what about um, how about we go to um, an actual uh, official PlayStation uh, playlist we find a um, video here here we go to show you this um, load PS3 YouTube's uh, feature so allow the page to fully load up here and let's just pause that video straight away uh, okay let's select the uh, bookmark it again and I'm going to immediately pause this uh, okay so um, how about this then uh, so this is an active queue uh, and I could jump to any of these videos on uh, uh, where I choose let's just click that to show you that so um, but uh, what if you select the um, the load videos uh, PS3 YouTube option let's try that so there you go it loads the um, the currently playing video on uh, PS3 YouTube so that's uh, that's ready to go now let's go back um, and um, so I could uh, jump to another uh, video so let's do that so if I select the the next one there and go back to PS3 YouTube there you go that's uh, that's loaded that um, and you can also you can also jump to a particular video so let's say we wanted to jump to uh, jump to this one and press R2 give it a second uh, and uh, there you go so uh, yeah not bad eh um, and um, to revert to the um, revert to the standard queue, you can just press the the stop button there. Let's do that, um, and that now restores the uh, shows the currently playing video. Um, so uh, yeah, let me have your uh, let me have your feedback, and uh, don't be shy about reporting any issues you find, because. Um, I can undoubtedly uh, sort those out. Um, so uh, yeah, enjoy.